I have a dream. I still feel like we are seen as the anti-citizens. Uh, I still feel like persons do not value either the potential or the contribution of African Americans. But I have a dream. My poor little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. What we're experiencing, I think, 50 years after, after Martin Luther King is actually quite similar to what Martin Luther King was seeing during the last few years of his life. When King was living, uh, black people were twice as likely to be unemployed uh, as white Americans. They're still black, twice as likely to be unemployed, and so that racial disparity has persisted over time. From my own research, levels of black poverty are very similar to the levels of black poverty when King was alive. You would tell white boys, for example, that um, if you're ever in trouble, go to the police and they will protect you, they'll make things right. You tell black boys, don't go to the police. Be careful when they come to talk to you because you might get locked up. I have a dream. Well, ultimately, we'll reach a point where the, the dream that Dr. King spoke of can be realized. But we have to be realistic. It won't be overnight, and it won't be conclusive at any point.